Hellerai here. This video is in response to a recent video Scholagrim made titled Discussing the Setup and Results of the Bow and Crossbow Comparison. I think a good way to improve those tests would be to pick up this book, Reconstructing Ancient Linen Body Armor, Unraveling the Mystery of Linothorax, by Gregory S. Aldret, Scott Bartell, and Alicia Aldret. Now, while this book is primarily about figuring out what linothorax was made of, how prolific its use was, things like that, there's an entire section on testing they did, and one of those chapters is Chapter 5, Arrow Test Methodology and Materials. This could save a lot of time and headache. Um, they pretty much have their entire method, their setup, the stuff they used, everything, all laid bare here. It talks about the material being tested itself, but it also talks about the types of arrows that they used, gives specific weights and dimensions, even the weight, dimension, materials, and such for the shafts. It goes into their calculating the joules of force the arrow is hit with. They talk about depth of penetration. They show some interesting setups and they discuss uh, how, how they did their target setup and why they chose the materials they chose. They have a nice method of marking which holes did which depths, which they go into. They talk about the distances they used, um, the different types of shots they used. The bows they used even, which were modern bows in this case, because they wanted to keep it within the realm of being able to quantify the draw weight. They even have these tables with the results of their many shots fired. They tested modern hunting-tipped arrows as well, which as you can see, went right through the stuff. They talk about how deep a shot would have to be in order to be injurious or lethal. They talk about the effect of angled shots and they they make a lot of interesting little observations in general that can end up just like I said before saving so much time and headache if you're looking to set up similar testing yourself. You can get this on Amazon new as a hardcover for around $22. And I'll probably put some links to different places you can get it for different prices or whatnot in the description below. Well, that's it for now. Have a good one.